What's happening? Thanks for stopping by the gym. Working on a couple Isak Pitbull crews, tricks, and setups today. But before we get into that, my name is Andrew Peach. I'm a certified personal trainer, certified adaptive special needs personal trainer. If you know somebody with autism or Down syndrome that you want to get started on a training program, my email is linked in the description. Hit me up and I would love to help you out. But we're boxing today. And if you like Isak Pitbull crews, then keep watching this video because we're going to learn a couple of his best setups and tricks that he's used to drop and to knock people out. The first trick we're going to work out today uses a level change and a feint. There's a huge left hand! <laughs> Cruz was showing Ramirez those level changes. And then eventually he level changed and threw across to the body that landed. And not even a second later he changes levels again, feints across the body, and instead comes with a hook to the head that put Ramirez down. It was perfect timing. Ramirez had his hand down, leaving that chin wide open for that hook. Whether you're shadow boxing, working on a double end bag, or working with a heavy bag, it should look something like this. And yes, you have to grunt. Let's try another one. This next trick, Isaac Pitbull Cruz used to knock out Diego Magdaleno. Working on the inside, he throws a beautiful hook to the body, transfers his weight to his back foot, and then comes with an uppercut. A few seconds later, same hook to the body, uppercut, doubles up on the uppercut and knocks him out in the first round. So whether you're shadow boxing using a double end bag or working on the heavy bag, it should look like this. Well, I hope you enjoyed that video. I hope you give some of these tricks a try. Again, my name is Andrew Peach. This is Peach Theory Fitness. I post about boxing and fitness, workouts, tips, highlights, and more every single day. Hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you back here in the gym real soon. I've got a couple more rounds left, so I'm about to get after it.